What's up, YouTube? My name is Batman, and I don't like sniping. Um, it's not that I don't like snipers, you know, I don't want to offend anyone. I think it's, uh, I've never been a big fan of blaming other players for something that I feel is wrong with the game. I think that's kind of irrational. The real, you know, the real, the real person to blame are the game developers, right? And sniping, I feel, uh, is seriously flawed, and it has been seriously flawed in every Call of Duty so far. Um, you know, arguably it was okay in Call of Duty 4, but, you know, I feel like the solution now is so simple and so straightforward, uh, but, you know, it's just, it's intellectually beyond what Infinity Ward, or Treyarch for that matter, can handle. Um, now, what I don't like about Sniper, there's, it's, there's never any reason really to enjoy a Sniper, right? If the Sniper's on your team, he's probably going negative and if he is going if he is doing well like if he's having a good game with the sniper I bet you 10 times out of 10 that person would be having a better game if they were using like you know any other weapon besides a sniper rifle does that make sense like you know like it's not I'm not saying that it's guaranteed you'll do bad with a sniper but I think it is guaranteed that you will always do better with an SMG a shotgun or an assault rifle you'll do better with those kinds of weapons than you would with a sniper rifle, you know? Um, and, 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 so if the sniper's on your team, either A, he's not living up, or he or she, they, are not doing as well as they could be, you know? And, obviously you could make that argument, um, um, in a very broad sense, and by the end of it, you would just be saying, you know, everyone should use assault rifles all the time, because that's what they'll do best with, on average, the most, right? Like, nobody should ever use shotguns, or whatever, whatever, you could throw them in there with snipers. But, the thing is, not only do I feel like snipers don't do as well as they could be if they were using a different weapon, they're usually doing very badly. Uh, they're usually going negative, they're usually going very negative. Um... And if you're a sniper watching this right now, if you do snipe and you're saying, not me, you know, I go positive all the time. I'm very good with a sniper. What are you talking about? Look, I get it. They're out there. You're out there. But you're probably like one in a hundred, right? Maybe even one in a thousand. You are a very small percentage of the uh, population of snipers. Very small percentage that can actually do well with a sniper. So it sucks to have it on your team. And it sucks to have it on the enemy team. Um... Because there are two ways a sniper can play, really, right? They can play how uh, snipers have traditionally been uh, viewed. They can play. They can play the sort of traditional sniper role, you know, of, of staying far back and hitting uh, the opponent with one-shot kills from a distance where you can't see him and it's hard to shoot back. But that's, I mean, that's the worst. You know, that's how it's supposed to be used, and it still sucks. It's it greatly slows down the game, first of all, because, you know, uh, they're, they're in a fortified position. They're usually overlooking an entire choke point and defending themselves from a distance, and it's really hard to get to them. Um, and so it slows the game way down, right? Uh, Infinity Ward's whole, whole shebang in Modern Warfare 3 was making the game as fast-paced as possible. You got, you know, support, killstreak, UAVs, so there's UAVs up. 24-7, you got, if you kill someone, literally the way the system works is they're supposed to spawn as close to you as they possibly can so they can come find your ass and, you know, it keeps it as fast-paced as it possibly can be. Yet they put snipers back in the game and it's like, you know, assuming they're not quickscoping, uh, which, which most snipers I don't think can do very well, uh, assuming that, they're slowing the game down tremendously because people don't know how to approach them, uh, first of all, and second of all, they're not approaching other people, right? Now, that's, you know, so traditional sniping slows down the game, it's boring, and it's just really frustrating to get shot from a million miles away. I would call you a fucking pussy uh, if you killed me in-game with a sniper from so far away that I can't shoot you, right? Because that's what you are. That's what sniping is. It's, it's about playing like a pussy, which has its place in Call of Duty, but I'm just saying, it's, it's, uh, it's a pussy move. Now, secondly, maybe you're quickscoping, right? Quickscoping is bullshit. However, I've done it, and I enjoy it, and I know why people enjoy it, and I don't think it should be taken out of the game, but it needs to be tweaked. Um, first of all, I don't think you should be able to quickscope with semi-automatic weapons like the Barrett. I think if you're going to quickscope, it, it, it should be that the only sniper rifles that can ADS that quickly are bolt-action sniper rifles. I think that would make it a lot more fair, because... 
you know, it's not bullshit when you get legitimately quick scoped. I just feel like, you know, okay, you know, he pulled off the quick scope. That was hard. He probably could have gotten that kill with a SMG anyways. But when you see them quick scope, they miss the quick scope, and then they just kind of like jam both triggers at the same time, right? And they can just fucking send 30 quick scopes your way under a second one shot quick scopes with a fucking Barret. That's bullshit, I think. Um, so I think it ought to be bolt action only can quick scope. And maybe even if you really want to make it balanced, maybe make it so that there's a perk for quick scoping that you have to have to quick scope, right? That would go a long ways towards balancing quick scoping. Again, I'm not advocating taking quick scoping out of the game. I understand why it's there. Because, frankly, Call of Duty maps are too small for snipers to really be used effectively the traditionally way, uh, the traditional way. Um, it's almost smarter to learn how to quickscope and use them to quickscope because you'll be more efficient that way than you would if you use them traditionally. And so, you know, I understand that, but I think they ought to make it balanced. I think maybe there ought to be a perk, you know, call it the quickscope perk. This is the perk that lets you ADS quickly and make it so that somehow you can only do it uh, with bolt action sniper rifles. That would be my solution. And... Secondly, or not secondly, but for snipers in general, I think the the hit damage, the damage per bullet, uh, I guess you just call it damage, uh, needs to be changed dramatically. Um, not dramatically, but <clears throat> I think it's bullshit that uh, you know there are those semi-automatic semi-automatic snipers that are uh, you know very low recoil, if any recoil at all. I think it's like the AS50. I don't know. My sniper knowledge isn't um, isn't amazing, but in general, I don't think it's fair that uh, a you know non-recoil, fully semi-automatic sniper rifle can kill you as quickly uh, in terms of like you know one bullet uh, as a bolt action sniper rifle. I think it completely. Uh, defeats the purpose of having a bolt action sniper rifle like why would you use a bolt ap bolt action sniper rifle that's one shot one kill when you can get one shot one kill uh with something that's low recoil and semi-automatic you know those those sniper rifles that the uh the controller mod hacker guys that they can use and basically turn it into a fully automatic assault rifle you know you you know you know who i'm talking about you know what i'm talking about um I just think it defeats the purpose of having a bolt action at all if you can do that with a, uh, you know, I mean, like I said, I'm not going to beat a dead horse. Um, and so I think they need to change the damage so that bolt actions are the only sniper that does one shot, one kill anywhere on the body, and the other ones need to have a more, uh, you know, you need to hit them in the head or something for one shot, one kill. This is Batman signing out.